Hi everyone, today we will discuss you about ideas and phrasal verbs. So, what are ideas? An idiom is a phrase with a meaning that's often difficult to understand by looking at the individual word. For example, my uncle just arrived out of the blue. Out of the blue means suddenly and unexpectedly. Second one, not all idioms are so difficult to get. Many phrases that are easier to understand are still listed as idioms in dictionaries because they have a fixed form. For example, I ring my mother every day without fail. Without fail is means always. Most idioms have a fixed form. However, with some idioms, alternative words are possible. For example, do you want to go out? That is the band. It the band means used to say that you are not certain about something. Why on earth are you shouting? Be quiet. Why, how, where, who, etc. On earth, use it to emphasize a question when you are angry or surprised. Sometimes additional words can be used within an idiom, especially to change the emphasis. For example, it makes a lot of sense to buy now, while the houses are cheap. Here you can see make things be practical and logical thing to do. Types of idioms. First type of idiom were based. Example, take advantage of something, get nowhere. This means make good use of something or make no progress or have no success. Well, second one is prepositional phrases. For example, in that case or in charge. These are means used to say what you will do something, having control or common. Third one, noun phrases. A piece of cake. It means a thing that is easy to do. First sayings or proverbs. For instance, better late than never. It means it's better to arrive late than not at all. Fixed phrases with 2K words, usually joined by and or or. Example, bright and early, or more or less, early in the morning and almost or approximately. Six types of idiom is idiomatic phrasal words. So, for example, get through to somebody or lost something off. Get through the, to somebody means make contact with somebody by phone and laugh something off, joke about something to show you think it's not serious or important. Last one is exclamations or short spoken phrases. Don't ask me. It means use it to say that you don't know the answer to something. Or thank humans. It means use it to say that you are pleased and relieved about something. What are phrasal verbs? Phrasal verb is a verb plus a preposition or adverb which creates a meaning different from original word. Example, I ran into my teacher at the movies last night. Here you can see run plus into uh, equal meet. He ran away when he was 15. Run plus away means leave how. Second one, some phrasal verbs are intransitive. An intransitive verb cannot be followed by an object. Example, he suddenly showed up. Show up means cannot take an object. Some phrasal verbs are transitive. A transitive word can be followed by an object. I made up the story. Story is an object of make up. Last one is some transitive phrasal verbs are separable. The object is placed between the verb and preposition. For instance, I talked my mother into letting me borrow the car, and she looked the phone number up. 
Some transitive phrasal verbs are inseparable. For example, I ran into an old friend yesterday. They are looking into the problem. He looked after the baby. Thank you for watching.